If you're investing in making YouTube videos, but you're not getting a lot of views, a few things could be happening. You might have bad SEO. In other words, folks can't find your videos, but you may be creating the wrong content for your audience. I'm Brighton West, and in this video, I'm gonna teach you how to map out the purpose, target audience, and value for each video prior to push and record. This simple exercise is guaranteed to guide you towards creating great content content your audience wants to watch. I always start my videos in a Google Doc. I have a list of each of my ideas and I pick some to work on. But before I start writing, I think about these three things. For each video, what is my purpose, who is my target audience, and what value will I provide? Let me go through these one at a time. Purpose. The purpose of your video is what you get from the viewer. Do you want viewers to subscribe to your channel? Do you want them to call for a consultation? Having clarity about what you want to accomplish is step one. Two, target audience. The target audience are the viewers who can deliver on your purpose. For example, if your goal is to get more leads for your plumbing business, then your target audience is probably homeowners in your service area who are having trouble with their plumbing. It's probably not apartment dwellers who want to listen to electronic dance music nor is it homeowners who want to listen to electronic dance music. Your target audience has the problem that you solve and the ability to take the action that you desire. And point three, you want point three, right? I want you to click the like button. Go ahead, click the little thumbs up. Lastly, what is the value that you're providing to the target audience? This one is easy. Unless your target audience is your mom, no one is watching your video out of pity. They are watching to get something that they want. Maybe they want to dance to electronic dance music. Maybe they want to lose five pounds before next Saturday, or maybe they have a clogged drain in their sink. The value is relief you deliver for their pain. In another video, I talk about whether you should give away your knowledge for free. I'm not gonna make you watch that video to find out. The answer is yes. If you can show someone how to unclog their sink with a coat hanger, then go for it. If they can fix their sink with a coat hanger, then they probably shouldn't be hiring a plumber. The more likely scenario is that the clog is something that needs a plumber with wrenches and snakes and some other special knowledge, and they're likely to hire that helpful person from the YouTube video who they feel like they already know and trust. Purpose, target audience, and value. It's pretty simple. Now another simple thing. If you'd like to see weekly videos helping you use online video to grow your business, click the subscribe button. I'm Brighton West and I create videos like this every single week and I work individually with coaches, life coaches, executive coaches, wellness coaches who want to grow their business with video. 